Uh, currently, we've seen um, um, over 100 patients that were uh, vi uh, came into the trauma center. Uh, we have 20 that were critical and over a dozen that required surgery right away um, and went to the operating room immediately with our staff and uh, others that are currently still in the hospital being managed with uh, chest tubes uh, and um, pain control issues and things like that and wounds that they're suffered from the gunshot. The, the emotional strain is probably the highest one right now from, a, from a, um, a foundation standpoint, you know, the hospital's at full operational status and uh, right now we're just trying to help each other and the patients uh, kind of get through this and, and help the family members uh, kind of just deal with this mentally. Uh, some of these wounds will heal physically, but the mental um, aftermath is going to be for some time.